بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم اینڈ ویلکم ٹو اینڈر انٹرسٹنگ ایپیسوڈ آف ایم ایس ایکسل ان دس ویڈیو یو ول لرن دا میجک آف فلیش فل اینڈ ایٹس ایپلیکیشن ان ایم ایس ایکسل فلیش فل از ون آف دا موسٹ امیزنگ فیچرز آف ایکسل اٹ گریپس ٹاسک دیٹ وڈ ٹیک آرس ٹو بی پرفارمڈ مینولی and executes it automatically in a flash. Excel Flash Fill is a special tool that analyzes the information you are entering and automatically fills data when it identifies a pattern. The Flash Fill feature was introduced in Excel 2013 and is available in all later variants of Excel. Flash fill easily copes with dozens of different tasks that otherwise would require complex formulas such as splitting and combining text strings, cleaning data and correcting inconsistencies, formatting text and numbers, converting dates to the desired format and a lot more. Each time flash fill combines millions of small programs that might accomplish the task then sort those code snippest using machine learning techniques and finds the one that suit best for the job all this is done in milliseconds in the background and the user sees the result almost immediately dear learners now let us see how flash fill works here i have entered some names and our task is to separate these names into name and surname column. I have created two more columns with name and surname. There are two methods. One is just you can type manually as I am typing Kesar and then in the second column Zaman and in the second you have to type all again. But if you are provided with thousands of name and you have to do it, what you will do? Here is a simple method and this simple method is available in MS Excel. So you can do this task professionally by entering just a first name. Here we enter the first name and we will use this data tab. Here we have flash fill option. You can see when you click on data tab and here you find flash fill. Now I enter the first name and click in the uh, next cell and just select flash fill here. You can see all the names are typed automatically. Now moving to the column C and here we have to type surname of all the given names. So again making it easy using data and then flash fill. Just type the first one and go to data tab and select flash fill. So you can see the column C is filled with your requirement. The surnames are automatically typed here. There is a shortcut you can use your keyboard for this purpose the shortcut key for this is control E. Here just click and then use control E and you can see without going to data tab and selecting flash fill we got it. Now if you are given another task and that is just to separate the first letter of the name. So we create a column here first letter of the name and then and now I will type only the first letter that is Q. As you type and then click in the cell below select flash fill you can see the first letter of the names are automatically filled in. If you want to fill it with uh, small caves or capital caves, you can do it. Pattern will not be changed. 
the data will remain in the same pattern as you entered in the first cell again first letter of the surname now first letter of the surname here we type we create another column for it and now here you will see that using flash fill we can do it just as the uh, use Z is the first letter of surname uh, and now using flash fill or using control E you can see as you use con uh, flash fill function or you can use control E the column is filled with that. Now if you want the country names to be displayed in capital letters so remember that flash fill always follow the pattern so we type Pakistan in capital letter in the first cell and then we use flash fill and all the rest of the names are in capital now now if your task is to show only first two or three letters of all the names so type the first two or three letters of each country's name as I type PAK for Pakistan and then use the flash fill or control E to get all in the same pattern. Dear learners, here we are provided with more than two entries name, age, country, city, country code and phone number and you have to separate each of them into separate columns. Here I have created columns for these entries. You can see every cell contain more than two entries. So same trick we will do again. Here in the first column type the name. We type name and surname mean both the parts and flash fill will follow the pattern and give you two names in each column next one is the age 34 years is the age of the first entry and here you type 34 now use flash fill or control E from your keyboard you will get the age of each individual the each members here is the country now we see the country of the first member is Pakistan. So type Pakistan in the first cell and click in the next cell and then use flash fill to get the country of each member. Next is the city. Similarly, we will type the city name for each member and then we will use the flash fill. Here I type the city of the first member that is Islamabad. And then using flash fill from data tab, you can get the city of each member that is given in the table. You can see the next is the country code. And similarly, type the country code of the first one and use the flash fill or control E from keyboard you will get each country code separately. Now the last uh, task is the phone number. So we will enter the phone number in the first cell and now using flash fill from data tape or you can use control E from keyboard you will get the phone numbers in separate column. So you can see that each entry is now in the separate column. Here let us discuss something more that if you want these phone numbers to be displayed in a different format as I type it. So the same pattern will be applied to rest of the entries. Flash fill and you can see all the numbers are now in the same format as we provide the pattern in the first column. So thanks for watching this video and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. In the next video, I will teach you 
how you can uh, combine data from different cell into the same cell and how can you uh, give different format to the data such as you can give different format to date entered in a cell. So thanks for watching. Goodbye.